you can use parent square to send parents field trip permission slips on the greenville tech page we have a copy of their traditional form which you'll want to download put your information in and cut and paste this because this is what's going to go inside of the permission slip then you're going to come to parent square and on the right side here we have forms of permission hit view all and you're going to want to create a new form and it's like sending a message or a post to families select your class and put a title in At this point, I've cut and pasted from the other document, the English and Spanish. And I like using this because it has the same legal language as our previous form. So that way parents can't contest saying they didn't understand your message. Then you want to come to click forms and permissions. Select the date that you need it turned in by. I'm going to pick the day of the field trip so that way any parent who forgets. Create a new form and then you're going to want to select this first one and leave the one that requires student information, but click requires student signature. And when you leave this box collect or checked for giving permission, this is going to have a I give permission or I do not give permission on the actual form, which is nice. And then once you have everything as you like it, you can take a look at preview. And here's the language of the permission slip. They will select their child's name. You can't do it because you, you're the teacher, but they'll check, select their child's name. They will then type their name, their email address, and a phone number, whichever they have. So we have that documented. And then they will type their name and then hit approve or disapprove. And you will have your required permission slip. When you like it, click post now. And there we go.